<laughs> Hi, it's Adrian. How are you doing today? And so I have um, a whole bunch of favorites so far, and I have a lot of them. So I actually may go ahead and make two videos instead of one because I didn't realize how many things that I've actually been really enjoying this year. And I have. So, um, as far as getting started, this is my mid-year, I really like this and I kind of like that and, you know, that kind of, uh, video. So, um, let's go ahead and start with some skincare and some under, yeah, some of the other stuff. So, um, let's see. So the Glow Drops by, um, Glow recipe I've really been enjoying, and also the watermelon glow um, moisturizer. These are both great to go underneath makeup, and um, I have the mini sizes that you can get in the sample pack that you can get it for most of the skin care, the most popular glow recipe skin care, and these are what they look like, and those are some of the ones that I've really, really been enjoying. Um, I've gotten a little bit more into primers, uh, not totally, but um, the She Glam primer, and you can get this on the Sheen website, and then uh, this is going to be a thicker, more of a moisturizer, the Milani Peach Primer, and this is going to be, um, well, it says it's for glass uh, glass skin and that's what I went ahead and used today and then the Lumi glow lotion from L'Oreal so these are the three that I've been using as primers that I've really been enjoying um, another product that's just really a standout is Maybelline uh, perfecter form one and this um, <clears throat> Definitely gives you a shiny glow underneath your makeup, and uh, I have it in shade 00. It doesn't come in very many shades, but if you want more of a glowy look, a uh, really good product to add in. So, yeah, that's going to be everything going underneath the, the skin here. And then, as far as what I have for the high end, uh, definitely loving the Kosas. Um, foundation. I have this in 110. And the Beautiful Skin Foundation by Charlotte Tilbury. Uh, this one's in 3 Coal. And uh, both of these have skin care benefits, so I'm really liking these a lot. And again, that's going to be for the high end. Um, as far as the uh, drugstore, ColourPop uh, Pretty Fresh. It just does it for me. Uh, this is the foundation. And this is the skin tint. I also use um, the concealer all the time. And once again, it's hiding from me. So if I find it, I will go ahead and put it in here. Uh, but I really like these two. And uh, they have hyaluronic acid in them. Um, both are really, really good products. And really, um, yeah, you can't beat them. So definitely ColourPop, you can get on the ColourPop website or um, on Ulta. ColourPop website's going to have more, um, well, the whole range. And this I've been using for the last year and a half and as far as um, maybe closer to two years. But the Sungasm, and this is by Catrice. It's their glowy powder. I use it as a finishing powder and really loving that as far as the summertime and getting a really glowy, glowy look. And again, the glowish powder as well. And um, yeah, loving both of these. They're great. As far as blushes, um, the Beauty Bay blushes. This one is Bloom, and it just has really nice texture to it. And then uh, Blossom, and again, really nice texture to it. And so, yeah, I'm really enjoying both of these. They store really easily. And so Beauty Bay, you can get on the Beauty Bay website, and I'm really enjoying those. Uh, Soul is a sister company to ColourPop. You can get it on the same website. 
And so this is the soul. These are their, uh, well, shimmering body powder. And I use them for highlighters a lot. Um, and they're set up in the same packaging as a highlighter. So bronze hour. And then this one is going to be starlight. And this one has the best name, Wildflower Honey. And this this one, it's actually a duochrome. It's what I have on uh, today. And it does go from gold to red. So really pretty. And again, these are the Soul. Um, they're listed as shimmering body powders. Uh, they're in the same packaging that the um, highlighters come in. In fact, I'll show you right now. Um, so this one is actually ColourPop, and it's going to be, yeah, let's see if we can get that open here. <laughs> okay. Okay, so here we go. So uh, this is a ColourPop. It's a highlighter addicted to you. One of my favorites from this year as well. It's out of the Apricot Me Not collection, and so... Um, as you can see, they are very, very similar. The formula is a little bit different, but they're both great. And it just depends what you what you want out of them. So, um, yeah, they're uh, really good products, and I'm really enjoying them all. And they were quite a surprise. When I got these, I was like, well, maybe, you know, for highlighter or whatever. Um, but... They really turned out to be great products, so I like these a lot. And let's see, what else do I have? Um, the Beauty Pie, and this one is the Bare Blush. And I have this in, um, it's a cream blush. I have it in uh, Raspberry as well. And both colors are just wonderful, really liking those a lot. And uh, I told you, I have a lot of stuff here today. Uh, she Glam Mascara. Again, She Glam you can get on the Sheen website. Uh, one side is volumizing, the other side is going to be uh, lengthening and you use uh, both uh, bristles or both, um, yeah, brushes to go ahead and get the look and that's what I used today. So really liking those as well. Uh, let's see, from ColourPop again, the Glowing Lip. And so they have all sorts, they have vaults of this particular formula. I love the Just a Tint as well. And I have uh, this one on, this is the Just a Tint in a Go-Go. And both of these formulas are available on the ColourPop website, and I like them both. Actually, I really like them both, so um, yeah. And this one is Lavender from the Peeps collection. And again, this one is just a tint, a go-go. So, um, loving those. Let me go ahead and get my next uh, rest of the products, and I'll be right back, okay? Okay. 